for our day two, we are now in Michigan, from Ohio to Michigan. So the first thing that you have to do is to check in on the hotel that we initially booked from Booking.com. And we don't exactly know what we're going to do after that. We'll probably check online later. We were hoping to get out of the car to have a picture from that welcome to Michigan uh, sign, but it's not a good place. So far, this is Michigan. It's way different from Ohio. I haven't really researched much about Michigan, but we'll see. We'll see. We need to get checked in first. So guys, we are now in Michigan. Welcome to Michigan! Again, we got no plans yet of what we're gonna do, but we'll check in first at the hotel in Monroe. Be fun. We're now at Travel Lodge uh, in Winter Monroe, and this is where we booked our hotel. It's actually it's a decent one, it's only for $75, and it got two queen beds. And it's very small, but what do we expect? It's only $75, right? So it has a very cute bathroom. Let me turn on the lights first. It's nice. It's decent. It's $75, man. It's only for a day. We're not going to be looking for something like a hotel type. This is, this is decent. I like it. You guys like the room? Yes. It's pretty okay, fine, it's right? Okay. It's okay, right? <laughs> yeah, Yesterday we, we checked in at was that Holiday Express thing? We only we paid like twenty ten dollars. But this one is only seventy five dollars. Yeah. Not bad for seventy five dollars. We cannot complain. Oh, we can't you can't complain. So we're here at the River Raisin uh, National Battlefield Park. I hope it's still open. We all do it's open. Look at that. So we have to go all the way here for us to see the park and there's river there. This is nature, although it's really cold. It's still so good. So I'm basically shivering right now. You wanna see the snowman? Right. <laughs> Say hi. In honor of the Battle of the River Race in 1830 to 2013, Nancy Graftal, Monroe Chapter, MSTAR. We need to leave now because we need to get our bags and all our stuff checked in. So we'll be here in Michigan until tomorrow and we haven't decided on what places we'll be visiting tomorrow. We're gonna check it online but I know it's gonna be worth it. And also later in the evening we'll be having dinner. It's gonna be my birthday celebration dinner. I was planning to treat them but they're saying, oh, we're just going to treat you today. I'm like, why not? I can get that money saved though. I'm supposed to go home already, but we decided to drop by and check the mall here. So this is the mall of Monroe in Michigan. We're actually not sure if this is open because look at the area. There's none here. Oh, there's, there's a family right here. It looks deserted. Is this open? Anybody home? Ooh, it is open. Look at that. It's so empty. You sure there are people in here? This is kind of weird. I can only count the number of people inside this mall. Is it because of the pandemic? That's why a lot of stores here are closed. 
I am being ignorant. I don't know what's happening here. Okay, looking good. I can see a bunch of people coming out from from everywhere. Here they go. Pinball. Funland. Dead in. Nothing. Nothing. Where? What are you planning to do? Nothing. <laughs> I guess this is it. There's nothing much to see here in this mall. Bye. Okay, so we need to have our early dinner at Red Lobster. Thank you, Tita Feli. You're welcome. The car. Birthday boy. Yeah, it's my birthday. It's my birthday. Happy birthday. So what am I going to be ordering for today? Have you already decided? Nope. Everyone's looking for the menu. They say if it's your birthday, they're gonna give you a complimentary uh, ice cream, so I'll be waiting for the ice cream later. And for sure, they're gonna be singing a happy birthday song for me. Quite So this is the complimentary ice cream for my birthday. Thank you, Red Up, sir. You know what's so sad? They sang a birthday song for me. I thought I was recording it, but I wasn't recording it. Oh. Happy birthday to me. Blow the candle. <laughs> Look at that building. That's the Wayne State University in Michigan. So we're now at uh, Detroit Institute of Arts. I think we need to see it for ourselves because that's one of the most recommended places to visit in Detroit. That's the Michigan Science Center. Michigan Science Center Planetarium. I want to see that. So before we go to the other one that I mentioned, we're going to be visiting first this Charles H. Wright Museum of African American History. But we'll have to pay $25 for the entrance, which is okay because we're already here. Why not visit what's inside? So we're closer now, Museum of African American history. God, it's really cold. <sighs> My fingers feeling numb right now. Let's get inside. We're already here. We need to see what's inside, though. Okay. Hey. Let's get inside. Ooh. This is so good. Walk to freedom. <laughs> I like history. That's why I'm really excited to get inside. So I got my ticket to get inside the museum and I need to stick it on my clothes. Let's get inside. King Tutankhamen. Whoa. This is real good. Some of them are the original. Some of them are just replicas, but looking at here, it's amazing. So these are just replicas, like this one. This attachment, the original a version of that is in Cairo Museum.
Don't get on them. Another room right there which actually shows African uh, trade, culture, and the slavery. I got goosebumps to be honest. I got a little bit scared because it opened my, my eyes and my mind on the important history and why these things are need to be to be known, to be learned and for us to be really be aware of that. We were not allowed to take videos and photos in that room because of copyright issues, but it's really, it's really amazing to know these things. And again, it really opened my eyes. This experience is a lot to take in. And it's a good decision to visit this museum because I need to know this. I am a, I'm a teacher and I need to be aware of this. I guess that's all for now for Charles H. Wright Museum of African American History. See you later. So we're going to that, I think it's a church. We need to see it. It's cold. 14 So you want to check what's inside Wayne State University a bookstore they're also selling varsity jacket and shirt Hold up hold up hold up Ooh fancy I want to get one, but I'm not actually from this school, but I still think it would be good. Nope, we didn't buy any, but it's a good look. Oh, we thought it's a church, but it's actually not. This one is a... It's university. It's also Wayne University. Ooh, fancy building. I hope my university is like this. It's humongous. It's really good. Wayne State University. All right, let's get inside now. It's really cold. Hey. So we are done with Ohio. We're also done with Michigan. But right now, we are now at Indiana. 